county of Somerset, between Shepton Mallet and Shedder, lie the Mendip Hills, rising to over 900 feet. The Mendips consist to a large extent of Carboniferous limestone, and it is in this type of rock that the majority of caves are formed. Until the beginning of this century, nothing was known of any major Mendip cave, with the exception of Wookie Hole and Lamlair. Lamlair Cavern is situated near West Hartree and is the subject of this film. As a safety precaution, the entrance is kept locked, but once the trapdoor has been removed, access is obtained to a 60 foot deep entrance shaft. Below the entrance shaft is a large descending passage with a floor of loose boulders. The walls are decorated with stalactite formations with a wide range of colours to be found anywhere on Mendip. The different colours are due to the salts of many different metals. Lead ore was present here in such large quantities that Lamlair was worked as a lead mine for many years. This chamber is known as the Beehive Chamber. The large dome of stalagmite on the floor was called the Beehive by the early explorers. chamber, a man-made passage leads down to the winch platform situated high up in the wall of the main chamber. The main chamber is 110 foot high and over 100 feet across. Its roof is beautifully decorated with stalactite. A 65 foot descent from the platform to the floor of the main chamber is made on lightweight electron ladders.
from the main chamber is a fixed iron ladder which goes to a ledge known as Valentine's Landing. A muddy passage leading off of this is being dug by members of MNRC. The return to the surface is usually more difficult than the descent and a party usually reaches Mendip Top with a feeling of satisfaction and a thirst that is not lost until late in the evening. <laughs>